It's that time. Once again, guys. Uh, wait, hold on. Nugget is trapped in the... Hold on. Wait, why is Nugget bleeding again in the next screen? I see... Hold up a second. There's something wrong with this. Wait, one second. It says learn good. Something else is going on here. Any more plot holes? No, please, no. All right, we're gonna stop there. Let's get this intro done. So what is going on guys? This is Ryan here and welcome back finally to kindergarten 2. I say welcome back. We've only just got started with this thing, man. If you guys have not seen kindergarten the initial playthrough I did, it was probably one of the best games I've played in this style. Man, link in the description down below. You've got to see it if you have. Now, for those of you who have seen this already, you probably know why I'm so hyped. And if you're not, what the freak are you doing? Listen, I can't wait to play this game. And that's what we're going to start playing this thing, guys. Uh, 20k likes for the next episode tomorrow. Let's do it. What is this? Limited edition 8-bit Ryan merch available until August 9th. If you get it now, you can you can get it because you keep it. See that link on screen in the description? Go, go pick it up, guys. I... <clears throat> I, don't know what, I don't know what to say. Play it now. Start with file number one. Here we go. A brand new adventure. But are we playing as the same character? And it does start on Tuesday, which we all said. Same character. Hey, it looks like this is a new save file. But be sure to check out the help section of the pause menu to learn the controls and stuff. Will do. Wait, wait. So, hang on. He told himself that? And then he agreed to himself? By the way, a huge thank you to the developers as well for providing me an early copy of this game. They are letting me play this one day before the release. So, guys, I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. Also, you guys hearing this new music in the background? Hold up a second. Alright, no more messing around. That's also where you can find the mission map. It'll tell you what story missions you can do with the stuff you've unlocked. Let me see it, got it. Let me see that good stuff. Hang on a second. This is totally different. There's literally achievements and storylines in this now. The Tale of Two Janitors, Flowers and Diana, the Hitman's Potty Guard. What, what the freak? Listen, we're gonna keep it classy, okay? We know who the janitor is for this one, but the Tale of Two Janitors is something I have no idea about. I feel like this is the one where we start, right? Uh, wait, start the mission by talking. Oh, so it's like giving us hints in terms of how we even get going with this stuff. Noted, noted. Thank you for the help, buddy. Okay, when you're ready to get started, head over to that door and we'll start our first day of school. All right, let's do this, man. Free roam all over again. What what poster is that? That looks like a Smash Bros one, maybe? Absolute ton of collectibles all along here, too. Let's interact with this thing. So what should I bring to school? You get the items for beating the various missions. Of course you do. Take a look in the closet right now. What am I wearing? Bro, your standard ass bullcrap stuff. Whoa. The monster mon. Dude, I remember so much about this game. So we can make our own deck from these things. Then we've got a switch right here. There's a button on my bedroom wall. I don't know what it does. Press it, of course. Okay, nothing happened. Whatever it is, I must not be ready for it. Bummer. Yes! But we will be soon. Let's get out of here, man. Am I ready to start another day of kindergarten? Dude, you already know you are. Let's get going to school. Look at this, the playground absolutely booming. We've got apples with people's faces on too. Dude, I'm like nerding out right now. So the janitor first, of course. Filthy, absolutely filthy. I, I, I agree to something. Are you blind? Look at this place. The other no-name janitor over there has really let this place go to crap. You don't know his name yet, or we can just say yes, bye. For now, we're gonna say bye. So yeah, see ya. We've got Bugsy right here, dude. She took my knife, that little snitch. She just made a very unstable enemy. What are you talking about? The stupid principal's daughter. She Wait, the principal has a daughter? She somehow knew I had it on me, and now I have study hall. This new school is stupid. We could help. Uh, I'm not nope. interested. Sorry. Bro, you look like me, but on a bad day, what happened? Wait, who is this? Hold on a sec. I can't believe it. It's not fair. What's not fair? What's your name? I want to know his name. It looks like a relative of Nugget. I'm Ozzy, and you're one of those awful new kids. I can't believe my friends got moved to new schools for this. How many were moved? Three. We got a bad deal, if you ask me. Now, the fact that that text right there was yellow, I think that means there is a story mission with that. Let me just walk to the side. Oh my gosh. Nugget, what the freak are you doing? Get out. Help! Nugget is trapped! How did you get down there? What do you want me to do about it? This is definitely not my problem. Bro, it is Nugget. We helped this man. First of all, how did you get down there? Nugget was searching for a suitable place for a new Nugget cave. So you crawled through a sewer gate? No! Nugget was searching for a suitable place to dig by the tree next to the handicap ramp. The ground starts to shake. There was a cave in. Your handicaps? What can I even do about that? Uh, I mean, we're gonna ask that one. Find help! Ask teacher, or janitor, or principal. Nugget does not care. Just get Nugget out of here. All right, all right, bro. Hang on. Hold up. So this is the second janitor, right? Dude, why does he look slightly like Wreck-It Ralph right now? Hey there, kiddo. I'm your friendly school janitor. Friendly? Yeah, I'd like to think so. Just let me know if you need any help getting adjusted here. I'm always happy to help. Can I get by here? Sorry, little buddy. Only kids with disabilities are allowed to use the handicap ramp on the side of the school. Okay, then. All right. Hey, uh, you're looking to buy something? Dude, I remember all of these characters. Like, they have the same roles, too. This is great. Now, what happened exactly? That rotten janitor didn't like that I corrected his spelling. But rest assured, 
reward, he's going to get what's coming to him. Okay, look, for now, let's just say about the handicap ramp. Hold on. What can I do you for? Hand sanitizer, lighter, battery. Never mind. At least for now, anyway. Hello, I'm the principal of this fine school. I'm so happy to have so many new students today. Sure you are. Not getting stuck in the sewer grate. Yes. Ooh, I'm going to say that straight out of the bat. Oh, the little odd child. Yes, I'm aware of that situation. You're going to do anything about it? Most certainly. I wouldn't just leave a student trapped in a sewer. The fire department is on their way to get him out. Thanks, I'll let him know. Oh, that won't be necessary. I have my sister watch over him. Or Margaret. I don't trust this person already. Huh? Who the freak is <laughs> behind you, sweetheart? Oh, how can I be of service? Wait, she should have more like a husky voice, right? There's a boy trapped in the sewer gate. Go keep him company. Yes, principal, sister, dear. So off she goes. Bro, what the heck? There, all taken care of. Is there anything else? What's wrong with her? Oh, I'm not really sure. It must be that all the new students have her a little on edge. Did she call you sister? Yes, she did. She was having trouble finding a job, and I couldn't let the poor thing starve. Dang, they talk a lot about this school, right? Oh my goodness, okay. We're done here. Oh, it's you. How's, uh, how's it going? Are you okay? Nugget is stuck behind the sewer grate. We can tell her too, let me ask. Does he have any pills on him? From the first game? I don't think so. Then he can stay down there. One less kid for me to worry about. You are a peach. Yeah. Let me talk to the woman again. Guard the boy. Guard the child. You're just keeping him company, right? The child is fine. He will be preserved. You okay in there, Nugget? Nugget is not happy. Nugget does not like this creepy old lunch. The boy is fine. If you continue to make him upset, you will have to be removed. Removed? Yes, removed. Ooh, do I be defiant straight out the bat? You already know I'm about to. Yes, you are. Wait, hold on. <laughs> Wait, hold up a second. In the old school, the principal, this was his kid, right? Go away, kid. I don't want to talk about it. Let's talk to Cindy. Hold up. This new school is so much more my style, especially with the new selection of boys. What do you think? I thought we were together. <laughs> In the last game. Let's say that one. Sorry, honey, but we're yesterday's news. Besides, we both know I'm too good for you anyway. I think this conversation is over. Yeah, it is. All right, who's this person here? Hello, my name is Penny. My mommy is the principal. I'm not going to remember all these voices, though. You must be one of the new kids. It's so nice to meet you. Do you want to be friends? I would love to be friends. Here, you can have this friendship bracelet. Uh, thanks. It looks so good on you. I'm glad we're friends. I'll see you around. Yeah, sure. Now, we've got these two shady looking fellas right here. Are they twins? Yours good, rectangle head. I told you, Teddy. This plan is foolproof. Just do exactly what I told you. I know. It's just, I don't know, Felix. This whole thing seems so wrong. Ozzy hasn't done anything to us. It'll be fine. Just quit being such a... <clears throat> How long have you been listening to our little chat? Not long. Good. I wouldn't want Ted here to get in trouble. Hey, why would I get in trouble? I didn't do anything. Which is just so typical for you, Teddy. I'll just save our family's company myself. Dude, I think that's everyone apart from this one character here, then. Hey, who's this one? Hey, you must be one of the new kids. I'm Carla. Do you have any contraband? Oh, for God's sake. Carla, for now, we're not messing with that. Listen, guys, I want to get started with the janitor's quest right now. Here we go. So the janitor thinks this place looks like a pile of crap thanks to the other janitor. You don't even know his name yet? What? No. But I guess I should learn it if I'm going to draw up a kid. Go find out his name. Okay, geez. So already... We're running them errands, dude. Let's go and talk to janitor number two. Hey there, kiddo. I'm your friend. Yeah, we know. What's your name? Oh, how rude of me. I'm Bob. Most of the kids around here just refer to me as the janitor anyway. You can call me that too if you like. Can I get by here? May as well stop talking for now. That's literally all janitor number one wanted to know. What's his name? Come on, I got a declaration to draw up. It's Bob. So my nemesis has a name. Bob. What are you going to do to him? He seems nice. Do you have a name? What? No! I lost it in the war! How did you lose your name in the war? War changes a man. You wouldn't understand. Which war? The best one. Which war is that? The one I was in. Haven't you been paying attention? Do you have a name? Um, that's what I thought. That's a brilliant point. I don't even have a name. So let's stick to the guy whose name we do know. What are you going to do to him? What the janitor's code of honor says I should do. Which is, janitors have a code of honor? Oh no. You have the wrong idea. It's my code of honor. I'm the janitor. What are you going to do? Of course. Which is, I'm going to kill him and take his mop. Seriously? You bet. Take his declaration of war and bring it to Bob. Return to me when it's done and this will be one for my history books. I guess it will be. Uh Dude, okay, so he's just gone by. What was his name again? Was it Monty? All right, Bob let him pass. Hello again, buddy. What's going on? The other janitor wanted me to give you this. Oh, thanks. I'll read it when I get inside. I'm really looking forward to working with him. I doubt that. And there goes the school bell. That's the bell. Everyone head inside to your assigned classrooms. Go to class? Great. Okay, kids, the teacher has a headache, so we're going to be very quiet. It looks like this school has more funding than the last one, since there are actually toys. Go play. Just please be quiet. Okay. People running off. Look at that. Straight to the toy box. They got all kinds of things. And as for me, 
I gotta pick and choose. Oh, I got Bugsy back here. You're not gonna play? What do you want? I'm busy trying to figure out how to get my knife back. It's probably better that he doesn't have it. Yeah, considering I'm sitting literally right next to him. Cindy's playing schoolhouse again. I ain't messing with that. All right, let's talk to this dude here. My dad drives a car like this. He said that when he dies, my twin brother Felix gets to have it. That's sad, Ted. Uh, wow. Destructo Tron was the best toy in the toy box. My friend and I used to play with him all the time before these new kids came in. What was the best toy? That's too bad, Ozzy. Then we have Cindy just here. I just love this doll. She's so pretty, just like me. Yeah, that's uh, great. Oh, bro. Monster Mon card right here. Hey, I know this looks like death right now, but my eyes still work. Now go and throw the people's cubbies. Okay. Wait, if I use an apple... Oh my god! Nugget is present! Yeah, and your arm isn't. No. Nugget is late. So you're getting study hole. Oh dear god, what happened to your arm? Nugget had to chew it off in order to escape from the failed Nugget cave. Why did you... <sighs> Never mind. Do you want to go to the nurse? You're bleeding all over the new classroom. Nugget is quite durable. Nugget will survive. If you insist, go ahead and play or do whatever it is that you do. <laughs> Dude, with... My dude takes a fidget spinner with the one remaining hand he's got. Nugget likes the fidgety spinny. What happened to your arm? Nugget chewed it off like a trapped coyote to help him escape. Your arm was stuck? No, Nugget just thought it was... Oh, can we leave the classroom? Hey, you can't leave. I'm responsible for you little monsters. I need to use the bathroom. Well, too bad I don't have a bathroom pass for this new school yet, so you'll just have to hold it. You don't look like you can stop me. I can still give you a study hall. Apparently that's a punishment for stuff here. Go ahead. That uses an apple, but here we go. Let me guess, this dude, nope. he ain't gonna let us pass. Hold on, new kid, you're only allowed to use the bathroom, nothing else. So I'm allowed out without a pass? Only until we can distribute pass books to you new kids. Now, if they go to the bathroom, we'll go back to your class. Pass book? We use pass books instead of traditional passes here, unless a special occasion that we distributed soon. Thanks for the info. Now stop dawdling and get back to class. Bro, I gotta take a leak, hold up a second. The janitor is in here again. Let's check out, the pot is right here. Should I use this stall? Uh, probably not, but I'm gonna do it anyway. I mean, we did need the bathroom. Sounds successful, good stuff. Ooh, he's blocking a doorway back there. Hold up a second. Tell me, boy, what is war? It's when people fight. That's right, but people can't fight if declarations of war are delivered. Oh, so we're now gonna fight instead. Tough luck, kid. I don't want to- What? Wait, I gave him the- Bro, I gave him the declaration. You've gotta be kidding me. <laughs> Some things just never change in this game. Wait, hold up, but I gave him the declaration thing, right? So- I wonder why that didn't work out in our favor on this occasion. Wait, there's another door here. This door leads outside. Okay, that one's locked up. Oh, what a shame. Okay, hold on. What's this on the wall? There are a couple of spiders on the wall here. I'm not touching them unless I can spray them with something first. Okay, we'll leave those. Wait, why would we even need to get through that part, though? That's interesting. Okay, so no matter what, when it comes to this point here, I can't get past the janitor. So I'm a bit confused because I definitely handed over the declaration he gave me. Okay, so let's retry this start a bit one more time, okay? He wants the mop. We know that. Now, look at this. I can give him this right there. There we go. That takes away the one where Monty can get through. Hmm. Okay, so he gets through there, but... That has all been given now. I'm a little bit confused then. Now, one difference before, we have one apple left and we can talk to the teacher right here. Okay, she is trying to convince us that the last school is actually much more dangerous than this one and we say we don't believe her. I'll tell you what, why don't we have lunch together? My treat. We can address any concerns you may have. I'll give you one chance. Oh, goody, here's a pass that will get you out of lunch. Just meet me in my office and we'll talk this whole thing out. I guess I'll see you then. This time though, we didn't mess with Nugget at all. Let's see, does that actually directly impact anything though? So I've got the whole pass, so I can skim straight by even now, correct? Okay, wait. I I got out quickly before Nugget even got in the class. Oh, hello. Lovely weather we're having. Nugget likes the weather. Um, <laughs> okay, so with this dude here now, let's see. I've got the pass, pass book. Wait, what do I got? I thought I had a pass book though. What is that? Wait, but I have handed over the declaration here. What is war? It's still the same thing then. So he doesn't want us to deliver the declaration clearly. Maybe we've got to do something just before that. Wait, what about if the apples indicate we go to him on the last one only. It's like the apples mark when something is coming up, so we've got something at the fifth one. That's with the dude with the lunch pass. I wonder what that could be. I mean, for now, look, let's go ahead and just use the bathroom, and I'll wait and use the apples up and talk to the janitor on the very last one. Okay, so we'll eat these. Now, we're on the last one here. If I talk to him, let me see what happens. So it's just saying... Okay, well, this is just great, isn't it? Yeah, okay. Okay, now this time, let's use up all the apples. Wait, hold up a second. Hey, you! That's the bell. Get out of here! Right, get out of here. That was it? There's nothing more in that? Uh, okay. Bro, Nugget is like profusely bleeding everywhere. What the freak? Let me talk to the janitor now. I really want to further this mission, so let me see. Yes, kid. Believe it or not, I do occasionally do my job. Good for you. So it's like small banter here. New school. Same kids to sit with. What's the point of this anyway? I don't know, Jerome. Yep, I don't either. Come see me at recess, kid. I'm in the middle of a very lucrative idea. Interesting to know. What like this dude? No kids allowed in the teacher's lounge. Go finish your lunch, kid. Need to get in there. I don't care what you need. I'm not moving unless there's a monitoring emergency. A monitoring emergency? Yes, a monitoring emergency. I deal with the 
them on a daily basis. You never know when delinquency or tardiness will strike. Uh, all right, so we could probably start like some kind of drama with that. What about these back doors here? What are you doing? You cannot leave. You have not eaten yet. That changed your voice again. I think I did. Oh, I'm going to see the principal. My sister wishes to see you, a mere child. She never wants to have lunch with her dear sister, but I guess that's not your problem. I guess not. Bye. So we're doing this. Oh, hello. Please do come in. All right, look at this rushing in right there. Look at this, dude. I'm so happy you came by. I'm always very concerned about the well-being of the students here. Right. Now tell me, what can I do to ease your mind about coming to school here? I assure you that you are quite safe. Can you answer a few questions? Can I look around? Let's do it. I look around my office? I don't see why not. Just don't break anything, okay? All right, teacher. Can't promise that. Oh, crap. There are a lot of books on the shelf. I don't think anyone interest me. We have the books. We've got a printer right here. Documents. It's a pink plan. I get the feeling that the science teacher had something to do with its creation. Most likely. We've got, like, moving boxes too and a shelf containing very little on it. Calendar in the corner here. It's just a calendar. Oh, how the season changed? That they do. You get an outfit for that? Okay, let's try and answer some questions then. So, what's with Penny? Where are the other kids? Where's your secret lab? Can I have a look around or can I go back to lunch? What else do we want to do here? Okay, my interest is piqued about the whole, like, other kids thing. Let's find out. According to the roll sheet, we have two children who are absent today. Everyone else is accounted for. Who are the two students? I'm actually not supposed to disclose that information, but after what happened yesterday, I'm not surprised that some kids are playing hooky. We don't have more students. We did, but to accommodate so many new students in just one day, two of our other students had to be relocated to a new school. I assure you they are fine. Right. I'm actually not allowed to disclose that information, but after what happened, yes, okay, you're repeating yourself. You don't have more students. We did, but to accommodate... You've said this as well. Oh, uh, but hold up a second. Dude, I'm stuck in a loop with this teacher. This is a very early build, guys. Like, they've handed me this way before the release, so this is why we're able to do this in the first place and, like, play it. These bugs are likely fixed, dude. I'll be telling them all about this anyway. Okay, guys, so now we're asking about Penny and how she is. I know, she can be a little difficult. She's been going through a bit of a rough patch, uh, mentally. How so? She was in an accident a few weeks ago. She's still dealing with the trauma, and so am I. What happened? Uh, I'm sorry, it's just a bit painful to relive. Perhaps I can answer some of your other questions? What happened? Okay, we're stuck in a loop again. All right, let me eat an apple. Hold up a second, one more. What happens with this dude? So he moves. That means this doorway here is now open because he's done mopping. Can we go in? We can't. This is a caution sign. I can't read it, but I assume it's warning me not to slip on the puddle. Probably so. There, the floor is dry. What more could they possibly want from me? Uh, yeah, good point. Bye. Let's further it one more. Okay, then we get the professor coming out. Where's he going though, right? Wait, maybe if we use the pass now, can we catch them both in there at the same time? All right, we can't, but you've got to see why my interest was piqued, right? There's a room over here to our left, so I wonder. Okay, with the professor gone, what about if I now ask about the secret lab? The imagination's on you kids. Maybe Dr. Dana has a secret lab, but I'm a bit more boring than he is. Aha, uh -huh. do you have any other questions? All right, can I go back to lunch? Certainly, I'll have the whole month to bring you back. Thank you so much for stopping by. I hope you feel better about being here. Okay, wait, yo. This dude's now gone out. Okay. I don't really know what else to do, so we're gonna finish up here for now. That's that done. The bell has rung. Be gone from my cafeteria. Anyone who has disobeyed our lovely principal today shall report to study hall. All others may go play at recess. All right, hold up a second. So, wait. What the freak? How, what, wait, why am I misbehaved? What the freak is going on? Well, well, well. Look at all the bad children. I expect you to behave until recess is over. Please take this time to reflect on how to be less awful in the future. There is to be no talking or moving until the bell rings. Is that clear? Crystal clear, sir. Okay. I said no talking. Sorry, I was meant to bring the mic in, but not, not shout, you know. Oh. So, uh, say nothing? Clever bunch. We'll see if it lasts. All right. Uh, no. Oh, God. What the freak? What the freak? What the freak? All right. Eat the apple. Ugh, the coffee I had during lunch is running right through me. I'll be back in a moment. Do not move or talk while I'm gone. All right. So he pops off. Dude, he leaves me and Bugsy alone. Yo, Bugsy, what the freak, dude? Hold up. Stupid study hall. First they take my knife, then they take my freedom. That sucks, Bugs. Wait, so in this... Dude, I can snitch the money. This is Teddy's cubby. There's three in here. Yo, take the money. Let's go. What about in here? There's a couple of toys. Take the toy car. Take the doll. Ooh, so this would directly impact, I think, Cindy's playthrough? Yo, we're gonna take the toy car because the dude mentioned that Felix's brother might get affected by it. We now have a toy car. Is there anything else in here we can do? Let me check around. There actually isn't, so hold up. Let's go through here. My apologies. Good to see you all behaving. And there goes the bell. Ah, oh, there's the bell. Anyone who pays their lab free can come with me to- Ooh! Dude, let's go! Hold up a second. I gotta check out this lab right now? 
look at this. Welcome to science class. Today's lesson will be about plants. Please observe the common plant in front of you. Notice how it is neither carnivorous or poisonous because the PTA is a bunch of cowards. Feel free to take a sample and look at it under one of the microscopes. This one won't do much, but it could if Ozzy's mom wasn't such a wimp. That freak, what does that mean? This air vent looks like it could be unscrewed. It seems to lead to the girl's bathroom. We'll ignore that for now. Bro, why is there a leg right here? Oh, I see you like the leg. I used to have two, but the other went missing. If you find it, please bring it to me. Leave the leg. Okay, uh, dude, there's a book over here. Look at this thing. What is this? I could have changed the lesson plan if I had gotten to this book. It's giving us hints already. Walk away. Okay, so this is not the only thing we can do, but it is one. This plant isn't poisonous or carnivorous, which makes sense considering that this is a school. Ignore the plant, so we can't take a sample unless we need, like, a thing to take the sample with. There's a plug here. This is an electrical outlet. It could be used to create distraction under the right... So we could get down the hallway, correct? I can't believe we don't get to do show and tell at this new school. What a bummer. I don't think you like the science. I don't, but I wouldn't be caught dead in those awful gym uniforms. Leave that to the ugly kids. Okay, darn it. None of these parts are the ones I'm looking for. What are you looking for? I'm trying to find something to upgrade the precision of the laser cannon on my chair. I'm going to use it to make that janitor suffer. Good luck with that. Maybe we can get that at some point. Yeah, other than that, there's not really much else we can do here. I've looked around basically everything. Oh, fish. There are some fish in the tank. There is also some small yellow particles in here. I wonder what they would look like. Magnified? Ooh, I wonder if we can get some. So go over here. This is a microscope. I can look at any slides I've taken samples with. Here we go then. This is a box of slides I can put samples. So we've got that. Let me see. I could get that or I could look at the fish. I think I might do this one. Take a sample. And then we go over to the microscope. Let's take a peek right now. Examine the slide. Oh, it seems you have discovered my little squids. They're so tiny. You can barely see them in the tank over there. I just think they're neat. And their ink is an extremely potent neurotoxin. And you're keeping them in a classroom? I'll give you one of those silly monster mon cards if you don't say anything to Ozzy. Deal. Dude. We got a tiny squid monster mon. All right, now, what about if I take one more of the slides? Or if I got one? Nope. You get one chance. That's it. Okay, well, we've got to finish up class. That's it done. Ah, another day of learning concluded. Please don't break anything on the way out. Leave the classroom and don't break it. And the teacher waves us out. Look at this, dude. Oh, my gosh. All these new casts and all the old ones, too. Uh, nugget still bleeding profusely absolutely everywhere, too. Wow. They complete. New clothing unlocked. We've got the cook save from the seasonal shirt and a monster mon card right now. Tiny squid. First day of school done. We start Tuesday again, of course. We already know how this goes down. All right, so head on over here a second. Look at this, dude. We can check this thing so it deals two damage. Reduce a red monster mon's damage by three. This... What the freak? Dude? Okay, so we can equip that. My deck is one card strong right now. Humble beginnings. And this lever right here is if we get all the monster mon cards fascinating stuff dude like that's just one little look at this game guys you already know i'm coming straight back to this real soon i love this game guys this whole help thing right here has me so intrigued with the mission help help we've got like skill trees so we start by talking to the janitor and it seems to lead on to different routes you see and the arrows point telling us that we can do this wait 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 i wonder if maybe doing these two things leads on to Nugget's thing, which we all have to do this in the same day, if that makes sense. So we talked to the janitor, but we also made sure to also talk to Nugget because the tale of the two janitors, I gave the other dude the, like, description thing, but I didn't see him again after that point. We have to find him. I'm really looking forward to figuring this game out. There's a lot we can do. Like, I've got cash right now. Like, hold up one sec. Let me talk to Monty for one second. Uh, let me see what stuff he's selling. Lighter, battery, hand sanitizer, never mind. So... The uses for this at this current moment, I'm not really sure. But there's got to be something. Maybe if we acquire the item, then one of them might want something. Guys, listen, this is where we're going to conclude this episode, though. This is Kindergarten 2. Uh, I don't want to do too much, considering, like, the devs did give me the game a day before release. Like, I don't want to go beating loads of the game just in one day, because I don't really think that's fair, considering they even gave me a day before release. For this one, though, guys, this was a look at Kindergarten 2. I said before, 20k likes for part two tomorrow. But if you guys did enjoy this video, though, why not drop me that like rate? And hey, if you're new around here, why not subscribe for more videos just like this one right here? So thank you so much for watching this video, guys. I of course hope you did enjoy, and I will of course see you on the next one.